What up? It's your boy Jay Banksy coming back with another one. And today, Royals versus the Red Sox in Kansas City. Um, Eric Hosmer, uh, newest member of the, the Red Sox, facing his former team, Kansas City Royals, who are uh, in last place in their division. I mean, well, we are too, but way worse record. Playing nothing but rookies and um, Salvador Perez. Shout out Salvador Perez. Should have should have be out Sean Murphy for whatever award he had last year, but one of the best catchers in the league, if not the best. Um, I got a lot to say. Um, yeah, let's get into the video. I mean, it's Kansas City, though. Like, they're playing nobodies. Like, Bobby Witt Jr., Chris Bubich. He looks like he bullies you when you lift. Just says, oh, I, I could have put that up in my sleep. See, look, the game started out real well. You get Tommy Pham sliding in the second. Jalen Davis started the game off with a walk. Things are looking promising. And this is what you do when you don't start Bogart. You get your guys like Devers to step up. Of course, MLB is going to show 5,000 replays until again in the next play. But, I mean, oh my God, it's okay. I'm trying to get to what I'm about to say. Like I said, you get your big guys and they produce. Top of the first inning. We're up 2 nothing. top of the first inning. They just gave us a two-run advantage in the first inning. Good piece of hitting by Devers. Pulled like a, a Jose Ramirez when he hit that double against us that day. Me, man. All right, this is... Yo, stop showing replays. We get it. Eric Hosmer. Welcome to Boston. Won a World Series with the Royals in 2014 or 15. When they went to back to back World Series in 14 and 15. He's at 14 and 15. First swing. Almost. If he hit that one out, woo wee! The Red Sox would have looked real nice after one. But no. The batting gives us a two-run cushion to start off the game. And then we got Pavetta on the mound. So when your team gives you a two-run cushion, you're supposed to hang a zero. But what does this dude do? Give a home or run. That essentially just makes it like a one nothing game. And then obviously we're going to show replays. Ten replays. Let off the game. You think you get out on the first batter when you're, when you're, you got the best stuff. So now a man on third and look. Some good baseball. Some situational hitting. So that's tie game. So after the first inning, you get a two-run cushion from your bats. That never happens. We never score runs in the first inning. Barely. And then the pitching just gives up two runs. And after that, we shut down. We shut down. It sets the tone. It starts with the pitching. I'm telling you. Look. Now Bubich is like, oh, my team's got my back. See? So he's a, he saw the batting step up, and he was like, okay, now it's time for me to shut it down. But when you bat first and then you go pitch, guess what happens? You pitch bad, your bat shut down. Don't worry, it's coming. It's coming. Wait till the seventh inning. I'm pissed today, man. I'm pissed. Runner goes. 
skied into right field. This ball hit well back into Jalen Davis at the warning track. He circles around it. He has to dive and make the play. And there are two down. I was I was about to punch the screen if he dropped that, yo. Well, that was a pretty routine fly ball. Don't worry, you get your dude though. It's not like it's all that. It's coming today. <laughs> it's coming today. To recover, he went running straight back and just misjudged where the ball was. Salvi hit 333. Shout out Salvador Perez though. Shout out to my guy. That boy, that boy flat out hits, bro. That boy flat out hits. So now look. Down 3-2. If reality struck, struck it'd be 2-1. Who knows? We might have scored because, you know, we dropped the two spot on the same guy. And now if we ain't hung a zero in the first inning, now the momentum is already ours. But they got it back right after. That's what good teams do. Not Kansas City. And no disrespect to the Royals. But y'all aren't having the greatest of years. So now look. Bubich starts settling in. Look at that. Confidence only got better as the game went around. Never mind. Bogarts was starting. For some reason, I didn't think he was starting last night. That's a mistake on me. Just so flustered, bro. And the Royals still been producing. Look at the wet dog, though. Pawecki wants to play. Been stepping up since Vasquez's departure, man. Him and Reese. You know what I'm saying? Let's go. So now it's 3 3. Right? 3 3. But what does. What does. Uh. Uh. Darwin's and Hernandez. I'm so pissed at AI show. This man, Darwin's and Hernandez. This dude cannot throw a ball. Ah! I mean, he can't throw a strike, but he cannot physically throw one of these. Cora folded. But, but the thing is, like, we have no pitching. And Darwin's and Hernandez hasn't pitched in ages. And God knows we don't want Sal Moore in there. But after this, Hernandez and Sal Moore in the same boat. This is so tragic, bro. And the Royals take the lead 4-3. And they have two on with nobody out. They 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 just didn't show look at this. So then look. He's already jogging I can't even explain it. Yep, and a classic replay. Classic 10 replays. Show it one more time. Show it one more time, please. Oh my gosh, bro. Whoa. Look at this. That's not a home run. I don't think so. And he sees it hit the pole. And so so it, it hits yelling, the green go, 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 go. part. He saw it, I did. Look at this. Oh, yeah. It hits Beautiful. the green part. That's essentially like it hitting the top of the fence. That's essentially like it hitting the top of the fence. So what is the difference? So I got a, I got a, a question to ask y'all. It hits right there. What is the difference from it hitting that versus that right there, the 330 sign? If it hit the 330 sign... What's going to happen? It's going to be a fair ball in play and everyone's going to run around. So it hits the bottom, the green. There's a reason it's colored green. That's what, why they made the park that way. To show that it is a fair ball in play and it is not the foul pole. He saw it, I did. Look at this. Oh, yeah. That should be in play. It wouldn't have mattered because they would have scored. But it's the principle. You know what I'm saying? But it's not like I care. It's off Darwin's and Hernandez. I hope it stands. That's a nice little cushion for the Warriors here. After review, the call stands. Get this man's face on there. So ass up, man.
I would have done it to any umpire. Not not just you. And take this as jokes. Because it's just a green screen. I'm not trying to punch you. Punch the green screen. Don't take this seriously. But I'm at, I, I am mad. But just in case some people get offended that, you know, I'm punching the green screen. Represent punching an umpire or something. I don't want people to get offended. This is all... Jokes. Now look. So Corey, so what do you want me to do? He says, I can't believe it. And he tosses him. He did not swear at him. I, I don't know. It didn't look like he said it. It said like, I can't even believe it. But, uh, and you know what's crazy? The, it says the third base umpire calls it fair and not a home run. And the umpire overturned it. That far away, bro. But yeah. We already know what happens. We shut down after that. That's it. That's all right. Man, double play. All right, whatever, man. Oh, my goodness. So, Cora gets ejected because the umpire knows. I forgot what his name was. But the umpire knows that he can't. Oh, how can you overrule a home run? From home plate. Says when you have you have jurisdiction over balls and strikes, that's you. I don't know why you have to rule home runs. You never go like what? Pack Darlings and Hernandez up. Pack them up. I'm done. I'm done. Alright, I'm not even talking about it. Announcement. Um I will not be reviewing the game tonight for tomorrow um i'm in a little cornhole tournament so uh wish me luck i will not be reviewing the game who knows maybe i might fit something in we'll see depending on how i'm feeling but listen i, I need to get a good sleep and the tournament starts at 11 so i uh, will not be you know reviewing the game or whatever but yeah why would i want to review the game if the red sox lose tonight Oh my, you got a lucky break, Mr. Greenscreen. You got a lucky break if the Red Sox lose tonight. It's awful. Awful, awful, awful. 